Hi everyone, so today I'm going to be doing a get to know me tag because I thought I'd just started all of this and not really said much about myself so I thought even though it is a little bit of an old tag um, it still would let you know a little bit more about me instead of just not mentioning anything at all so <clears throat> I'm just gonna get started. I've got the questions on my phone, so I'm just gonna go through them. Um, number one, what is your middle name? I don't actually have a middle name. I'm just a boring first and second name. Um, number two is share your favorite subject in high school. Mine was probably media just because it was everything that I liked. So it was like cameras and editing and making your own, like being creative and being able to make your own. Well, I think we made our own film at one point, which I really enjoyed. I'm not talking about like a two hour film. It was like 30 seconds long, but I really enjoyed doing that. So yeah, that was probably my favorite one. Um, what is your favorite drink? Um, We'll do soft and alcoholic just to switch things up a bit. My favourite soft drink, if I could drink it all the time, would be or fresh orange juice. Um, but because it's not like the best for you, I normally just drink water, which is so boring. Oops. So boring, but yeah, I don't really like pop and things like that. Um, my favourite alcoholic drink at the minute is gin, which is probably everyone's answer at the moment because it's like the new in thing but I do love raspberry gin and lemonade and I also like porn star martinis you can't really beat a porn star martini number four is what is your favorite song at the moment um I find questions like this so hard so I never know what my favorite song is until I'm listening to it and I'm like oh yeah I really like this song and and at the minute I don't really have one um I mean, God's Plan by Drake is really good, but that's just a hard question that I can't really answer. Um, number five, what would you or have you already? No, I have not. Named your children. Um, if I had a little girl, I would name her Lila, because I, I just like that name. Um, and if I had a little boy, oh, I always get stuck, like Noah or Oscar, I like names like that, but um, I haven't really thought that much into it because I am only 21 and that's not really my plan yet. Um, number six, have you ever participated in any sports? Yes, I used to do netball, swimming and dancing most of my life. Well, most of my life. I haven't done any of them in like six years. But yeah, I did all three of those until I was about 14, I think. I want to say that, but it could be a lie. Um, but yeah, now I literally do nothing. So that's something that I do need to start because I'm running a half marathon in September and haven't stopped training yet. Um, number seven, what is your favorite book? I really like Girl Boss. The nasty, is it the Nasty Girl book? I'm not really sure, but it's a really good book and I would highly recommend. Um, and I'm also reading Fern Cotton's Calm which is great so far and I would highly recommend again so I love them uh, what is your favorite color favorite color is pink or black I'm quite a plain person I love black I wear it most days so if that can be your favorite color then we'll go with that but I also do like pink um, what is your I keep saying M um, um, your what is your favorite animal um a dog i've just said it again um i literally cannot stop Whew. my favorite animal is a dog and i really want one but it's just not realistic we live in a flat and we don't have a garden so 
it's just not gonna happen anytime soon. But I, a girl can dream. Right, so number 10, what is your favorite perfume? My favorite perfume is Chanel Chance. It's the pink one. I love it, I'm obsessed. But I also do like Gucci Bloom at the minute. because It's a very spring scent. And it's getting into, getting, getting into spring, which I'm happy about. So them two are probably my favorite at the moment. What, number 11, what is your favorite holiday? Um, I do really enjoy skiing, but now that winter is kind of over, I am ready for summer. So I do like a good summer holiday. One of the best places I have been is Dubai. Um, that was incredible. But I am, I think I belong on the slopes. I do enjoy a skiing holiday. And I prefer to be too cold than too hot. But I don't tan or anything. So when I go on holiday, I kind of sit in the sun because I just, I, I just get, I just don't like it. Sitting in the sun, I would end up having to go in the pool or anything to cool down. Number 12, on a scale of one to 10, rate your childhood. 10. I, I couldn't really fault it at all. Number 13. Have you been out of the country? Yes, I've been out of the country. Number 14. Do you speak any different languages? No. I mean, I would say I wish I could, but I I'm, I'm just don't have the patience to sit and learn stuff, which sounds so bad, but Obviously, yeah, I had to do them in school. I did French and German in school, so I know the odd word. But um, yeah, I don't, I don't speak fluent in any other language. Number fifteen. Do you have any siblings? Yes, I have one little brother called Jack. Um, he's probably watching this video and thinking, "What are you doing, Hannah? This is so uncool." But never mind. Um, number 16, what is your favourite store? If you can count online places instead of an actual store, I would go with Pretty Little Thing at the minute. Um, but if not, I do really like um, Topshop and Primark at the minute is good as well. But yeah, my go-to place at the minute is Pretty Little Thing because I love it and it's really well priced affordable is the other word for that number 17 what is your favorite restaurant um in newcastle oh, i have a few this is so hard because i'm i'm not one to choose one place but i do really like milan Carter. they're like the best burgers in newcastle that i've tried um but then i also like sorella sorella which you will not know what that is unless you're from the uk but i literally love it so much it's a little italian restaurant and me and my family go there all the time it's a bit embarrassing how much we do go but we'll love it so yeah number 18 did you like school yeah kind of if i was to go back I probably would have done it a lot differently. Um, I think at that age you try to impress people that you don't really, you now know that you didn't need to impress. So if I was to go back, I definitely wouldn't try as hard with the people that I didn't need to, if that makes sense. Um, but yeah, I did enjoy it in general. Um, but I was, I was kind of happy to leave. I still see my friends that I went, went all through school with, so it's not like I don't see anybody anymore. Um, number 19, who are some of your favourite YouTubers? I am obsessed with Sophia and Chintzy at the minute, literally obsessed. The content is so good and they're so fashionable, makes us jealous. I'm just, I want them to be my friends. I also like watching Aisha and Zelia. I think that's how you pronounce the names apologies if not but yeah i love watching their channel as well um brogan tate i've been watching her for years her weekly 
weekly vlogs are really good and she's made us really want to go to Disneyland. Um, Lydia Millen is another one that I really like. Her new house is incredible. Um, who else? Ellie Darby, really like her as well. She seems really genuine and just our uh, videos are so bubbly and I don't know. I just, I like watching all of them. They're my top four I would say at the moment. I don't think well obviously I watch so many people but they are my top four go-to's at the moment um, number 20 what is your favorite movie it has to be anger songs and perfect snogging that came out at like the age where I was the same age as them in the movie and it was just the most relatable thing I've ever watched and I, st I, I don't even know how many times I've watched it probably about 50 plus but I love it it's probably the greatest film I've ever seen number 21 what are some of your favorite tv shows depends if it's on netflix or on the actual telly because I watch the classics like made in chelsea and towie when it's on and things like that I know they're not even that good but I just can't not watch it now that I've watched it for so long uh, as for Netflix, I was obsessed with Gilmore Girls, but I'm yet to finish it because it was so long. I've, I watched like three full series and I was like, this needs to stop. Like, I, did, it, I, I couldn't see it going anywhere, but I was obsessed when I was watching it. Gossip Girl, obviously I've watched that like two times. Like two times, but there is obviously a lot of episodes crimey program so like silent witness when it was on the last series is just finished and um, like 24 hours in police custody 24 hours in a I love programs like that number 22 PC or Mac um, I have a little MacBook Air but it's a couple of yet well it's about five years old now and it's the smallest one so the screen is tiny so when I edit my videos and things, I use my boyfriend's like PC. I'm not even really sure what it is. Just a normal Windows laptop, which I find it easier to edit on a PC rather than a Mac. But I uh, I do want to get an um, iMac, but just right now I have nowhere to put it. And I obviously can't afford it because they're like <sighs> expensive. So yeah, I'd probably say PC over Mac. Number 23 is what phone do you have? I have the iPhone 7 I think, it's just the matte black one and I have this little cute case which just has HR on, which I love, which was from Amazon and it was like £2 I think, I got it for my birthday. Um, next question, number 24, how tall are you? I am, last time I checked, 5 foot 10 I think. Um, yeah, 5 for 10. Number 25 is, do I have any pets? And no, I don't. But like I said, I would love a dog. So once we move out of here, even though we've just moved in, but once we move out and get our own house and somewhere that has a garden and things like that, like we're all going to look into get, getting a dog. I've talked a lot with my hands this video, but I don't know what to do with them. So yeah. I haven't got a pet but I would love a dog so yeah that's all the questions done hopefully that's give you a little insight into what I'm like I hope you enjoyed and let me know if you've got any ideas just pop them in the comments let us know if you like this video if you did please subscribe and maybe give this video a thumbs up who knows but I hope you enjoyed and thanks for watching. Bye.